Greetings, crypto enthusiasts. Welcome to Virtual Crypto again. Here I have found, I looked through the internet. Okay, the flash loan scams, the flash loan attack codes that you find in YouTube are all scams. Okay, here is a sample of the code. Okay, here is one programmer he decoded the codes why these flash loan contracts are scams okay what you will find in most common flash loan scam attacks okay flash loan attack scams okay these codes are total scams okay see he mentioned it this is a comment bar okay here this input button these are all fake these are all fake apis okay import flash loan demo okay it's known as flash loan demo blob here itself it is written blob many people don't see the contracts okay many investors or many people who wants to do flash loan attacks they are just like you and me they are just we are all just wanting to copy paste codes and make money as fast as possible okay it's fine people have greed people want to make money as fast as possible but make money by knowing what you are doing okay don't make money by not knowing what you are doing see here alex this import or oh, importing of api github api these are all fake okay these are like blobs as it's written here flash loan demo blob these are blobs landing pool okay it's here landing how landing pool works it's like a digitalized you know network marketing scam no it's like digitalized multi-level marketing scam okay it's a digitalized ponzi scheme this flash loan attacks codes are digitalized ponzi scheme okay pancake swap smart contracts these are all bullshit as they said these are all bullshit okay and you might see there is ifpa ipa ipfs okay these are private files okay private coded files okay this import here code manager means here the wallet address of that scammer is imported okay what happens here is the money that you send okay for true gas fees or initial funds all money goes to the scammer's wallet address okay the scammer's wallet address is in there it depends from scammer to scammer okay it's a very you know well thought digitalized ponzi scheme that people are promoting okay see contract manager perform tax what this code does is does is that it perform tax okay to return all the money to the scammers co wallet address you don't have to understand all the things okay even i'm a beginner at coding but I have created few of my own apps okay few basic apps so I can understand okay I can understand where the right variables are okay what creates for what variables I can get a glimpse okay if you if you just take a basic classes of JavaScript or flutter which I'm taking right now you will understand what uh, variables or this other things are okay you, you leave that what this contract does is that the con this contract creates a fake liquidity pool okay what happens is that you can see here get flash loan this get flash loan means it doesn't mentions get flash loan from where these are just like you know a dummy variables okay i always had a question in my mind that without putting any token symbol without attacking any token any coin in a dex how can one okay how can one get instant returns on their on their you know on their investments okay through just simple copy pasting it's not easy the blockchain the whole the whole meaning of blockchain is to make it truly secure okay and DeFi is not stupid see you enter any token amount okay here token amount is not written okay it's string means entering just any any token name okay the token name which you haven't even created yet okay 
there should be a name for creating tokens but there is no function like this beware if you see this type of codes okay here in the function what happens is that after entering your token amounts what happens is that you transfer all your funds to the scammers address okay here in address payable okay this is where all the money goes to the address of the scammer see this coder's name is marcin mats matservak i don't know who is this but if you have found my video i'm also promoting that these all flash loan attacks are scams okay here is one more why these are scams here is one more reddit post okay these are all legits pancake swap multiplier finance flash loan scams okay even they have noticed okay true coders will notice because flash loan attacks are not that easy okay what happens with flash loan attacks is that you have to take the perfect moment to attack the arbitrage system and when the attackers actually make money out of those arbitrage there is a fake pump okay there is a fake pump in that particular coin okay for example if the coin is around one person up okay by flash loan attacks the coins percentage might go about 10 to 20 percent in that particular dex okay in that particular decentralized exchange or centralized exchange the centralized exchange are not attacked okay only decentralized exchanges are attacked mostly so here see people can see sending bnb to this address but no one receives any bnbs okay see take a bnb loan from multiplier friends these are just fakes okay thousand these are all ponzi, ponzi scheme okay well thought ponzi schemes 50 percent bnb for dying at the time of the one bnb okay create your own pools see what happens is that when when more and more investors okay do this copy paste codes okay what happens is that the amount of gas fees fake gas fees the amount of initial funds that you all are providing one by one okay they are not even one people it's more and more people okay say 1000 people 1000 people okay say 1000 people enter around 125 bnb base 0.25 bnb okay that's into 1000 okay 250 bnb okay in videos you will also see that you need to require to enter initial funds okay so after entering 0.25 initial funds what happens is that a liquidity pool is created okay after a liquidity pool is created what happens is that the next time when you enter again 25 bnb you might get a profit of say once once you do it you might get profit your 2.5 bnb might turn into say 0.96 bnb or point one one point five bnb okay one point two bnb okay that's two fifty minus one point two bnb okay this is what happens in that particular liquidity pool system okay and one investor doesn't does it once they do it again and again so basically what happens is that you are creating a liquidity pool okay you are just getting back your own money okay in roi but what happens is that when you put on uh, you when you keep on doing it more and more okay when you say you have done you have done it around 10 times to get the profit you have already invested 2.5 bnb into the liquidity pool okay you have already already entered 2.5 bnp into the liquidity pool if you have done it 10 times and to 2.5 bnb it means that you have given 850 dollars into the liquidity pool 
so next time when you put in a liquidity pool okay there is not only you there are also other investors or other people who are wanting to put in who wants who wants more and more money out of the liquidity pool so what happens is that as you are not only doing it there are 2.5 bnb is created by 10 investors 10 copy paste coders who wants to become millionaire by one by one night okay all the wannabes that is 25 bnbs into 340 340 dollars okay what do you that's a pool of eight thousand five hundred dollars okay that is eight thousand five hundred dollars of liquidity pool so obviously when you next time put in 2.5 bnbs okay you are you might you will get only 4.5 bnb or maybe say you get 10 bnbs okay that is all because enough of the people has given enough of the people has invested their liquidity pool into that into that code okay into that particular code from that scammers wallet address so what happens is that when you get 10 bnbs you will think that it is your profit but it's not your profit okay and rest of the profit what, what will happen to the 8500 pool okay there won't be 8500 dollars in bnb pool what will happen is that say there is 8500 in bnb pool total bnb pool created and from that the hackers will obviously take four thousand five hundred dollars okay that is still four thousand left for you all to get your own profit okay this is a ponzi scheme okay so the the more money you keep on putting the more liquidity is generating a new token is generated it means that the scammers token is generated okay that's why there is no name for any any token okay that is why it is written here token name token symbol that is why in the videos you will see that you, you can create any token amount so a, a dummy token is already created with that the dummy token what happens is that with that dummy token you will get your roi based on the amount of pool okay based on the amount of liquidity pool present in that wallet address so you will never get say you will never get one thousand dollars okay you won't get one thousand dollars at once that's why people say that don't take too much of loan so if you put in one thousand dollars okay say there is four thousand liquidity pool out of so I say there is 4,500 left in the liquidity pool. Okay. And you take 1,000 and you get profit of say $1,500. Okay. $500. There is still 3,000 left. And when more investors take more and more amount of loan. Okay. The liquidity gets finished. Okay. So when two, three investors does it. Okay. 3 into 500 there is still 1000 1500 will be left okay 1500 will be left out of 3000 liquidity pool present in that you know fake token fake liquidity pool created so there is all huge risk okay these are all scams okay you can see i will give the link to the codes in the description so it's basically digitalized ponzi scheme okay the last one to get in will get the fucked most remember that it's just like meme coins but meme coins are better when a community works on a meme coin the value keeps on going up until it becomes total mainstream in the whole crypto market like dogecoin like shiba inu that is what the fake liquidity pools are crea created two liquidity pools one pool for the scammers one one pool for 
you all investors who wants to just copy paste and gain as much money and amount easily that's why you have seen that you need to at least put in 2.5 bnb what is 2.5 bnb 0.25 bnb not 2.5 0.25 bnb 0.25 bnb into 340 dollars that's 85 dollars okay that's 85 dollars you put in okay that's why people in the videos you will see that if it, if it doesn't works once do it again okay when you do it again 85 into 2 that's 170 dollars contributed by you by one investor okay that's 170 dollars contributed by one investor and keep on doing this again and again say 15 have in so say 15 has contributed okay 15 into 2 that's 30 that's 30 times by 15 investors okay twice twice from each investors 30 into 85 dollars okay 30 into 80 no one 30 into 170 dollars it's 5100 dollars created okay the last three won't get money but the first one to take out the uh, money will get the liquidity for example you invested that's 5100 created so if you invested 2.5 again the contract code will get executed after that after that your 0.25 might turn into 1 bnb like this it works okay so it's like a first in first out okay that is what first in first out so there will be enough liquidity pool created and 5000 it's not only 5100 uh, from 5100 contributed by you all investor half will be taken out say let's say for example 15 dollars 1500 dollars 1500 you know yes 1500 bnbs has been taken out okay that's three, okay 1500 dollars has been taken out that's still 3600 dollars dollars remaining okay and 1500 dollars divided by 340 for example that's 4.4 bnb profit for that scammer okay he will keep earning pure profit he will keep earning pure profit the ships will be those who are creating pools and doing the first in first in first out thing okay anyway at last when you keep on taking more and more loans what will happen is that at at last the liquidity pool will gas out and then again you have to keep on do uh, putting in money into the liquidity pool that is how it works okay liquidity pool is created after liquidity pool uh, the scammer will ov obviously take half of them half of the money generated by the liquidity pool for, for from the down liquidity pool okay the scammer will get pure profit but but what will happen is that the dummy liquidity pool that is running investors will have to fuck themselves okay they must have to fuck between themselves and the last one will get wrecked the last one into last one in will get obviously wrecked so this liquidity pool the liquidity pool generated by the dummy investors has to keep on filling on okay it has to keep on filling on till a huge amount of liquidity pool is created after that you keep on generating that you will get roi on your money but still it's fake it's a system of digitalized scam it's a digitalized ponzi scheme only after enough liquidity is created you will get money okay so you are just giving more and more money to that scammer that scammer will keep on getting more and more money okay he will keep on getting profit from the liquidity pool because 50 to 80 percent will of it anyway will it will get you know it will get wiped off okay 
so if i want to so if i created a code like this and tell people that it works what will happen is that if i want i can guess out the total liquidity pool at once so 8000 8, say 8500 dollars has been created in the liquidity pool i can take out eight whole 8500 out of the liquidity pool two three times okay i can do this as much of time i want till the investors don't realize this is what happens this is the scam what happens you all don't realize i kept on telling you all it's DeFi is not that stupid this is just a dummy code created for dummy pool okay where all the money goes to the scammers wallet and okay the and rest of the money the dummy pool that is generated investors fight between themselves just to get and a simple ROI DeFi is not stupid actually there is a huge process there is a paper I will give that video later on this is a well detailed video on how flash loan scam works okay you are only making the scammer richer and richer it works only when you fuck other investors so if you want to do you can do it there is another video that was created flash loan on wealth finance oh my god okay this I, ips ipfs okay this is just a private file storage that is created you can encrypt any file see what happens here brave themselves show that it's a private file system ipfs interplanetary file system is a public network for peer-to-peer -peer data storage okay and delivery this protocol has different privacy consideration from privacy con okay you have to see this thing these are all private files okay these are all private files imported in these codes okay say the code is this wallet address okay the code is inserted here the code is inserted here what you are doing is that by importing the code is inserted here okay the code is inserted here and then after the code is performed all the money goes to this wallet okay there might be two wallets created there might be two two wallets okay under important okay what the scammer will do is that he will run his another code another code okay from where this code will be connected this flash loan attack code will be connected and from there or else he will have two wallets okay you will see two wallets they will have two metamax wallets from one wallet they will keep on sending the funds to their other wallet and leaving the rest of the pools to make it look through okay the rest of the funds will be kept in the wallet so say from example from one wallet the scammer will keep on from the dummy wallet where does liquidity pool is submitted the scammer will keep on transferring those wallets those funds from to his other wallet leaving few funds in the dummy wallet so scammers will keep on getting richer you are just making the scam richer more and more richer by putting more and more bnbs so 0.25 bnb for every transaction and it might not even work once you have seen here it might not work once but you have to do it again and again until you get more and more profits this is the scam what is happening okay so the, here is one more video he is telling that you can thank me later it might be that he is maintaining the liquidity pool okay send 0.2 bnb to the contract for gas fees and all swaps okay 0.2 bnb as initial funds on top of that you have to pay gas fees okay you call the function and execute it it's not that easy but it is easy when you create a dummy pool okay this code is under his wallet addresses there are two wallet addresses he'll be scamming you you can see these are all scams i can search in any flash loan attack all everyone will be having their own 
everyone will be having their own interplanetary okay interplanetary file system these are all private files where the wallet is connected okay there might be two wallets connected here okay get flash loan from where flash loan they will get there is no Ave protocol or anything is written there action send required coins there is no token this is another code which i have seen convert half bnb to dni these are all fake there is no protocol written which is related to Ave or any any other finance defi defi websites add liquidity sin add liquidity repay flash loan address these are all fake okay see fake written flash loan blob remain contract this is a fake liquidity pool created to lure in investors you might get your money okay by putting in 2.5 bnb or 0.35 bnb so what happens is that the more bnb you put in the more and the more you do it okay then only you will get say some investors comes before you he will get more money he will he might he might take 1000 of bnb loan and then he will fuck rest of the investors so before you click on so before you get your roi you might get wiped off just because the investor so just because the investor before you came in and he took most of the loan and he cleared out that liquidity pool and doing it three times okay by invest only 0.4 see 0.45 bnb by investing but with gas three point i got nearly eight million beyond second time okay eight bnb created that's even like that's like they might this what this scammer has done is that he must have to maintain the liquidity pool say there there is five eight thousand five hundred liquidity pool created he just might take one thousand dollars out of the liquidity pool that is still eight seven thousand five hundred left so each time you add 0 0.5 to 0.44 bnbs as summer you're just keep on in, keeping keeping on adding it okay the more and more people are doing it the more and more they're getting it okay but still you have to do it for five to eight times which means that after, which means that you have already submitted say 0.44 bnbs eight times you have already submitted three bnbs out of that so the next time you do you might get five bnbs that is not by you done by you okay many have also created invested money in there so which means that which means that after rest of the investors have invested their money okay rest of the investor invested money you are just getting a profit out of others invested liquidity that is what happens so if you have invested to you next time in the ninth time you might just get three bnbs okay out of your eight times submitting it and then you keep on doing it you will think that you are just getting your own profit if only one investor is investing in the liquidity pool he will never get any ROI even if the hack, hacker or scammer is not even pulling out from the liquidity pool okay these are just scams that I have explained you all in detail so if you still wanna do it you can try okay these are all scams Okay, scam, make five minute multiplier scam, these are all scams. Okay, there is no token name. You think it's so easy, flash loan text. These are all fake codes created for fake dummy pool. Where you are only making the hacker richer and richer time by time. So tell me what you think. Are you still going to make your scammer richer or do you want to make money by investing in fundamental coins by fundamental meme coins that has huge potential
and fundamental blockchain coins that has huge potential that's why i'm calling out all the scammers that is how it works if you want shortened version of this video you can i will upload a video okay in diagrams and all but this is a detailed video on why you should not do this fake flash loan attack scams okay flash loan attack scams are not easy because flash loan attacks are actually illegal in DeFi space it's not regulated yet but it is actually illegal on top of that these creating this dummy pool these are all scam i will give link to this video to this github page this is scam okay i have even saved this github page i will even save it in front of you so that you know i keep on uploading i keep on showing that these are all scams people trying to scam you people might say the these are codes okay they might even show that how flash loan is paid flash loan is only repaid by the amount of people has invested in that dummy liquidity pool at the end of the day 50 to 20 percent or even 100 percent will be going to the scammer so tell me what you think okay tell me what you think on this video i will give a shortened version of this too okay say one to three minutes to five minutes this is 31 minutes so that i have explained in detail these are all scams don't trust on these codes these codes are a perfect ponzi scheme okay perfect ponzi scheme how ponzi schemes work by in, by by investing by collecting all the money from on the investors and then paying back to investors one by one leaving the last investors out of money leaving our uh, last investors bankrupt that is how ponzi scheme works okay see how Pom ponzi how ponzi scheme ponzi scheme works See, a Ponzi scheme investment that pays existing investors with funds collected from new investors. Ponzi scheme on have often promised to invest your money and generate high returns with little or no risk. Instead, they use it to pay those who invested earlier and may keep some of them for themselves. See, this is a digitalized, digitalized Ponzi scheme. That's why I get so pissed of this fucking bitches if i could just have the thanos gloves i could have i would have you know i would have clicked those cameras out of existence now you can see how this cam works a dummy account is created and then the last of the investors are fucked they are wrecked only the first investors they will get money that is how it works it's a ponzi it's a digitalized ponzi scheme it's a digitalized multi-level marketing ponzi scheme you keep on doing that if you want if you still want to take risks you are you can take risks but remember at the end of the day you are only making the scammer richer that is all if you want to rack other investors you can do it but at the end of the day remember by putting in 0.25 BNB or 1 BNB, you are only making the scammer richer. Thank you. You can thank me for saving you all. That's why. That's why. Subscribe to Virtual Cryptic to stay away from fucking Ponzi scheme scams, especially digitalized Ponzi scheme. No one has ever created such a digital it's such a detailed video in whole YouTube. That's why these flash loan attack codes are all scams. They create multiple YouTube accounts just to just for the you know show, uh, just to create a fugazi, just to create a facade that people are investing, like a social proof facade to lure in beginner pussy investors who wants to 
earn who wants to be a millionaire by one night that is what even i fell for that beginners will fall for this okay and it, this cycle will keep on continuing ultimately making the scammer richer that is what happens so stop doing this flash loan attack scams okay stop stop falling into the flash loan attack scams invest in meme coins okay it's better it's way profitable invest in all coins okay and invest in defi tokens invest in blockchain tokens okay go to coin market cap okay that is how you can do that is all subscribe to virtual cryptic for raw true videos on how to avoid scams how to invest in gem meme coins how to invest in gem all coins and how to invest in gem blockchain blockchain tokens and to stay updated to the overview of the market no one has ever created a video like this in a detailed video on digitalized ponzi scheme in this whole crypto market subscribe to forja cryptic for this detailed video and comment down comment your views that if you want shortened version of this video with detailed you know diagrams or not anyway i'll be uploading it with detailed diagram this is just a detailed video on how the digitalized ponzi scheme works so subscribe to virtual cryptic